so welcome to my channel so today i'm going to be doing a uh, unboxing well it's not really an unboxing it's more like i'm seeing i'm letting you see me unbox something that i plan on using but i like completely forgot to wait and record me like unboxing it for real so i'm kind of like reverse unboxing um it is a dutch oven so i'm unboxing a dutch oven today and um so yeah i'm gonna show you just like what it looks like and i'm going to show you what um like if you don't know like how to take care of your cast iron anything because it's cast iron so i'm going to show you how to do that uh really quick and yeah so i'll be right back i'm gonna set this camera up so you can see me unboxing it and yeah so i'll be right back all right so um i couldn't really get the camera set up the way that i uh, wanted to I'm going to show you what type of Dutch oven I got. This is my Dutch oven. As you can see, I paid a lot of money for this. And um, even though I am, uh, I opened it up, you can see I was like doing some stuff. I'm just trying to open it. It's all cracked and all this other stuff. But I'm telling you, it's brand new. And this is kitchen supply and um this is 5.5 core pre-seasoned cast iron but i'm gonna tell you right now if you don't know how to take care of anything cast iron that boy can de-season all right that is the top obviously uh, this is the top of the thing this is cardboard This boy is heavy because on top of it being five and a half quarts, it's also iron, obviously, so it's heavy. I look like James Brown. How you take care of the cast iron is um, what you want to do with any cast iron thing is you need to re-season it. You re-season cast iron by, uh, so what you want to do is after you use it, After you use cast iron, every single use, make sure that you wash it really good. Make sure that you wash it really good. And you wanna, you don't want it to air dry. Like, as soon as you wash it, take some, uh, even if you use like a dry, like a, a dry, well I call it a dry off towel, but the towel that you use to dry off your dishes and stuff like that, make sure you go over cast iron with a paper towel because you want to get any droplets off of there, okay? Any water droplets, try to get them off, okay? So then after you do that, go right behind it immediately with some olive oil on a paper towel and just cast iron the whole darn thing, okay? Every part that you washed. So if you wash that top, like mine, like mine, if you washed the top of it, you need to, if you wash the top, you need to make sure that it has, um, if you wash the top, you need to make sure that it gets olive oil. Now, once you put olive oil on it, you need to put it in the oven. Now, some uh, things might come with instructions already like uh, my cast iron came with its own instructions so I just followed the instructions just in case it was something different and for my cast iron I uh, I uh, put it on 350 degrees the oven let it preheat um, and so give me time to wipe everything down then I put it in there face uh, down the top and the pot and I let it go for about an hour to an hour and a half. 
um and that's just what they suggested by the manufacturer so with this cast iron so i just follow the instructions but if you have any cast irons at home that maybe you don't remember the instructions or whatever try to do that the same way uh 350 for about an hour okay what that does is the olive oil re-seasons it but it also keeps it from rusting because again it's cast iron and you don't want all that oil on i mean you don't want all that water on there that's why i'm telling you to make sure that you completely dry that oil i mean that water off of it because if you don't you can rust that cast iron and it's going to be jacked up especially if you paid a lot of money for that cast iron it'll be so jacked up it won't even be right anyway guys um i couldn't really the only reason why this is a short one is and i couldn't really show you what i wanted to show you is because you know i didn't really have the space but like the next unboxing that I'm going to do, I'm going to make sure that I have space for it. Anyway, if you enjoyed that and you learned something out of it, leave a comment, like, subscribe, and um, I have more videos coming, more unboxings, and I hope that um, you learned something from uh, this culinary video. Um, and like I said, if you're a culinary art student and you have no idea what a cast iron skillet is, I just told you. Also, you know, if you're an aspiring chef, I just told you that too, okay? Something to learn. Alright, so anyway, thank you for watching. Um, like I said, I look like James Brown, but I got shrinkage. You know, I look like James Brown, but that's okay. James Brown was famous. Well, thank you for the 11th time, and I will see you later. Subscribe and yeah peace out